So I was thinking the other day, this is either the stupidest idea I've had on this channel or the most creative. So basically, we've all been having a tough time with COVID and you know, travel restrictions. I've been trying to stay home, stay healthy, keep my family healthy, but I miss playing games of skate with people, man. I miss, I miss the challenge. It was always a great way to warm up. So I asked myself, how can I play a game of skate by myself? I'm gonna be playing a game of skate against myself, I think, if that makes any sense, on my phone. I'll show you guys what's up. First things first, I'm gonna ask my phone to flip a coin, and that's how we're gonna determine who goes first in this game of skate thing that we're doing. All right, let's go. I'm gonna say tails. Flip a coin. It is tails this time. I don't know if you guys can see it. Now, because I don't know exactly how this is gonna go, I'm only gonna be going to SK8. I'm gonna start with something super simple. I'm just gonna go for like a front 180. Yeah, front 180. Okay, we landed it. So I just landed front 180. So now the computer, my phone, the other person is on defense now. I have a land and miss wheel. About two thirds of the options are a land option and about one third are miss. Cause that's about where I am right now with most of my tricks. I land them about two out of three times, save for the new tricks like variable heel flips I just learned, maybe land those like one out of three times. And I'm making up these rules as I go. <laughs> so let's give it a shot, let's see what happens. It's my set. Go for a back 180. I've been doing these quite a bit recently. I don't know why. Oh. All right, so although that was like the worst attempt at a back 180 that I think I have ever done, I do want to see what this is going to land on, on offense for the computer. So it's gonna be a nolly front shove, so that should be no problem. For those of you who don't know, nolly front side and back side is kind of weird. So typically, if I were to do a pop shove like this, it would be back side, right, in my regular position. Front side, right, switch is the same way, fake is the same way. If you were to do a nolly shove like this, that's front side. Nolly front shove, no problem, no issues there. So let's go and see what this guy is gonna land on next. This is one of those tricks that I have just learned recently and I'm not too good at them. Oh, that was fun. I danced on that thing to the other side of the lot. <laughs> I'm taking the S, that's an S for me. I just actually learned these, but I kind of scoot them on the ground. So I'm gonna go for a bona fide big spin attempt and see what happens. I'm probably gonna eat it. This is how it'd be in a game of skate, right? You go up against somebody, you don't know their bag of tricks, and they might know all the tricks that you don't. I'll take it, it's okay. It wasn't until now that I realized that I will be on defense this whole time because there's no way for me to tell whether or not they're landing or missing this. So because this landed on big spin twice, I'm gonna say that he missed. We're on offense here, I'm gonna go for fakey big. Oh! It was really ugly. Let's see if my phone lands it.
All right, it's K to K. All right, let's see if I can win on a tray flip here. That's kind of my style. So my camera stopped recording, but I did catch it on the GoPro. I landed a tray flip, that was my set. Yeah, as you can see, all these missed attempts are next to each other because what I did was like land, miss, land, miss, an equal amount, and that puts them right next to each other. And then the additional 10 to add that extra third of misses, I guess they all just grouped up. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I actually had a lot of fun making it. I thought it was gonna be a, I thought it was gonna be a little complicated and making up games and challenges like this has always been a blast. I've always loved doing things like this, especially when it comes down to skateboarding. You know, sometimes flat ground can get a little dry. Sometimes you need to just sprinkle some spices on there, you know what I'm saying? If you guys wanna go ahead and take this game and make it your own, add some new things to it, by all means, give it a shot. Let me know what happens. Let me know if you win. If you guys have any suggestions for future games like this, just leave it in the comments down below. Definitely check it out. I love doing things like this, and I have a couple more in the future that I already got, uh, already got locked and loaded up in here. Until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video.